Alright guys, today I'm going to be showing you kind of an old gold farm. It's completely RNG based, so I mean you could get one of these in the first run, or you could run this a hundred times and not get one. I mean it's just kind of kind of a look based. And that would be Shadow Fang and the Gloom Shroud Armor. And they both sell, I mean there's none on my server right now, so you could pretty much call the price. Uh, Shadow Fang has always went for from 20 to 35k on my server at least, and uh, Gloom Shroud. I've only gotten once because it's it's a lot it's it's more rare than Shadow Fang definitely, and I sold it for 60k a while ago. Uh, you could probably get more out of that. I'm not for sure on your server, but like I said, it's going to be Shadow Fang and Gloom Shot Armor. And the way you're going to do that is you're going to come up here in Silver Pine Forest and come up here to Shadow Fang Keep. Put the raid difficulty or the dungeon difficulty on normal so you can run this over and over. And I suggest eating Bear Tartare which makes you faster every time you kill an enemy so that's really gonna help and go ahead into the dungeon alright guys I know this is kind of an old old dungeon to run but I figured I mean a lot of people may have forgot about this and uh, there's n neither one of these are on my auction house right now so I figured you know pretty good thing to run if you can get one if you're the only one with on one in the auction house you know it's, it's kind of a good thing and pretty much anything in here can drop shadow fang which is a, a twink sword and gloom shot's also a twink uh, a twink item there's I know there's not a lot of twink uh, players nowadays there's not as many as there used to be but there still are some and they still want this stuff as you can see guys this is my first run <laughs> literally making this video and I just got a shadow thing and uh, that's actually it's actually pretty insane it's my first run today first run in a long time actually and uh, that's that's pretty that's pretty insane, but uh, we'll keep running this, and I'll show you guys what drops the gloom gloom shot armor. All right, guys, how I suggest doing this is to run in here real quick, kill these, and then run up this backside. And then I run back down in here, and uh, I'll just go ahead and kill everything. All right, guys, right when you come out of here. Now, Wowhead says the Gloom Shroud drops from uh, mobs in this area and one more area of the dungeon. It doesn't say anything about these gargoyles, but these gargoyles definitely drop Gloom, Gloom Shroud. I've got that's I've only got Gloom Shroud twice, and both times was from these gargoyles. And as you can see, sometimes it won't let you loot them for some reason, uh, but it definitely will. It might not let you loot the first two, but it definitely will the second two. Uh, as you can see, let them come all the way to you. And uh, loot them. And let's see, we didn't get it. But like I said, Gloom Shroud is really rare. I've only got it twice. And I've gotten about 15 Shadow Things. And I've really not even ran this that many times. Now, guys, like, what I do is, uh, I'm not real speedy with my runs, so I don't really care to be locked out for a minute. So, what I do is I jump back down and go up these steps over here and run back out and reset it to keep from having to go through everything again. But if you want to keep going, you can. You can. Or if you have a druid, you can you know uh, teleport out and teleport back, and you'll be at the beginning of the dungeon, which is usually what I do. It's very convenient. But I never feel like uh, coming all the way through and then going back out because I'm just, I guess, lazy with this. So, but Wowhead uh, says these mobs right up here drop Gloom Shroud right here, I think. Uh, but I've never seen it drop anywhere but the, but the gargoyles. All right, guys, and that is the dungeon. Like I said, make sure it's on normal so you can run this m multiple times and you can run back out. You can jump off the bridge like I do. It'll be quicker, but you'll be missing out on several kills up here. But I mean, if you're not too lazy like me, you can run back out. Or like I said, be a druid and they can just teleport out and back in. And uh, yeah, guys, uh, Shadow Fang, like I said, 20, 20 to 35k usually. And uh, Gloom Shroud, anywhere from 30 to 80k, I guess. I sold mine for 60 a while ago. And uh, I've never sold a Shadow Fang less than 20. So, like I said, if you can get one, if you can get a few, you're doing you're doing real well. I mean, I just ran I ran this one time. And I got a Shadow Fang, which that is pretty lucky. It's RNG based, but you still. And uh, yeah, guys, good luck with it, and uh, we'll see you next time.